I'm recording that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is a lead in, I guess. Um, should we introduce ourselves before we play the video or during yeah. the video? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. All right, well, I'm the lovely and talented Sarah Jaffe. And, and I'm uh, a uh, world renowned, famous, beautiful oh. uh, music video producer, director, John <laughs> Collins. And this is the Clementine commentary version of the video. Clementine. So we're going to talk over the video and ruin the really beautiful music. <laughs> there are my six only male friends in Denton. <laughs> This, uh, most of this first half of this video was shot out at the first ranch in Argyle, Texas. Um, Very close to Ditton. Yeah, we, uh, we kept tried to keep everything as close to this area as possible. Cross-eyed in that shot Hold right on, there. Let's, let's, let's pause. pause that right there. Um, the sun was actually, I should say that it was about uh, 110 degrees the first day of shooting. This, I think this shot was the first day. Cross-eyed. Oh. The sun was so bright and I was struggling. <laughs> uh, this robe was actually made by a good friend of mine, Rachel Nicholson, who also lives in Ditton, and uh, she's an amazing uh, fashion designer. Yeah, and the uh, guys' costumes came from Christina Shoto, also Dentonite. I think pretty much everyone in this video is either Ditton or Dallas mm -hmm. people. Well, except for Will Johnson, who you'll see at the end. Oh, I'm going to pause this. This is my second favorite shot. This one? Yes, absolutely, of the entire Really? Day. Yeah, absolutely. I love this shot. You look quite stunning and it's just i think it was very happy with how the sky is out of control we did do a lot of post sky replacements um texas isn't really that it was blue the part of texas yeah. we were in wasn't really that epic looking <clears throat> but the video needed to be epic the song is i love that shot right there that was like a lot of that was a reminiscent of a lot of shots we did or a lot of um i guess referencing to like pause. a lot of the knife videos and fever ray that that one in particular video that we watched of, uh, I guess it was Wigsop. Yeah, It was absolutely. all night shots. Um, yeah, we, that was a really big inspiration. And I should also mention, we've kind of passed it, but the guys, the six guys were, um, oh, yeah. I was very inspired by uh, <coughs> a, a European photographer named Lawrence Winrin. Oh, that, that picture that you showed me. That's yeah. right. And uh, so that sort of was the inspiration. Behind the inspiration that. for that, exactly. And then this definitely Royksop, Bjork, uh, we wanted to sort of hit that same... Channel them. Yes. Playing. <laughs> <laughs> this is the where I'm being is. edgy. I'm being edgy <laughs> right here. Emotional. That was actually all shot on green screen and in the studio. Um, we weren't allowed to shoot at night due to... Uh, snakes. Snakes. This is also all green screen. Ooh, I'm being um, really emotional I right probably here. shouldn't give away too many... Uh, Jeremy case, Buller's hands. In case people don't recognize... Uh, what is Trenton Wheeler, Seren, Stanton, Stevens, photographer. We had Glenn Ferris, Anthony Longoria. Anthony Longoria, Clayton McConnell, Clayton McConnell Jeremy, Jeremy Buller. Buller. Ooh, I'm flying. There so you should, yes, please tell us about the flying. Uh, when John and I first met together to discuss topics video, um, I knew just a little bit of kind of what I saw vision-wise, but I, I think the only thing that I certainly knew was I wanted to fly and later have a nosebleed, which you'll oh, no. see this later. Is, this oh, is yeah, another spot we have this. to pause right here. Um, <laughs> right up to where this cuts into the next shot, Glenn Ferris, who's actually dead center of the screen right now, takes a nasty spill it, off of this little ledge here. Mm -hmm. Christina um, had actually given them boots which i mean they look so sharp and they look like little banana republic models but um <laughs> and i got the idea to say hey this would be really cool if y'all jumped off this really <laughs> harrowing looking cliff glenn took yeah he basically just they were all running and he didn't have any tread on his shoes so he literally <laughs> very literally tumbled down the hill on this uh it was kind of epic actually and he kind of got up <laughs> and he had, it was there was blood everywhere and everyone was just kind of like this silent gasp like we were, oh, yeah. very no. all very worried and concerned for his well-being and he was just he was smiling fine. and laughing <laughs> and then we smiled and through laughed. bloody God. teeth and it was just <laughs> <laughs> very was really harrowing good. so yeah my glenn. fault i take full responsibility glenn for i want to i wish you would have youtube now i love this show. this is actually that the running and this, the running shot was highly inspired by Levi's jeans commercials. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I think that's such an epic shot of them. They're so stinky. <laughs> that uh, robe is actually, I think it was all polyester. So there were many times of points of delirium were reached where I was just... You're absolutely a true bird. <laughs> I don't know. Wearing that and just being directly in the sun. Uh, I should also mention that from here on... That's cool too. I love, the, I love the beginning of the video and I'm really happy with how the video came out, but this is some of my favorite of the video is just from here on the to the end. Half, yeah. yeah. And I, I, I love great. the, I love the reverence of the guys and, um, mm, me too. when they're carrying you and which will, you'll see in just once. There you go. That's my favorite. These are, I love these shots. I love how they came out. I love how you perform them. And I just love that. It's so reverent looking because we all should revere you. <laughs> I think it was the sun that was beating everyone down. Oh, you should pause that right there. Okay. We're pausing right there is, uh, what I like to call, um, it's funny, and I hope everyone uh, doesn't see it as I do. I spot it every time. Baby arm. <laughs> the most intense baby arm. I do this in a lot. Like it's, I won't I won't elaborate on it, but that's that's just some baby arm right well, there. Well, you know, you didn't want to hit anybody in the head. As okay, everyone were. just squinting with, like, torture. Yeah, everyone I think just at that so point hot. you can see that the sun is just beating down on them. These poor guys kept having to pick me up and then put me down and take off my shoes and then put the shoes back on and they were champs. I was loving it actually. <laughs> so this is on the same ranch that we were on. It really dovetails really nicely into the Hamilton Pool shots to follow. This was actually the location of a Walker, Texas Ranger video, or video, a Walker, Texas Ranger <laughs> episode. I um, just want to walk with him, like hand in hand. <laughs> walk with him to the river. Love that shot. I love these shots Hamilton too. Pool. Hamilton Pool. That was, Austin, the fun, that was a really fun day. I was excited to be in the water. Really cool. Very exciting place to be. And actually, that location was actually using, of all things, Robert Rodriguez's Predators, which oh. shot a week before we got there. Um, but ours came out first. Ours did, and there's Will Johnson. Will Johnson, ladies and gentlemen. He is a deer. He set, actually stood waist deep in water for about four hours, and been. I think he had Hamilton the perfect look day. for the part as well. Yeah. It was really important that we don't have a creepy sort of vibe to it, and I think he looked really warm, very inviting, and he's just a really I great guy. Will. Yeah, it was really cool to meet him. I really like that he's kind of the guy who's baptizing you as we have the established, very well respected baptizing mm -hmm. the up and coming. Yes. So um, we're going to pause here <laughs> at the end because a lot of questions have been asked about this last shot. And I'm just going to further confuse you. There's really no explanation for this nosebleed other than um, I think they're just really cool looking. I also like to go to the mall. So... Um, <laughs> I think nosebleeds are cool, and I like to be. I like to go shopping at the mall. So that's uh, that's me in a nutshell. Just really <laughs> deep and complex, and um, no reason at all. I think they're just really visceral looking, and there it is. Well, I, I finally get my dream. My dreams have come true. I get to fly and have a nosebleed. <laughs> this will be the only part of the video that I will actually explain. But for me, it's like a a representation of the actually what happens during the process of baptism. Mm. So like yeah. the good battling out the bad and yeah that, that was the cool thing about it is that i think when you and i talked about it that you put it perfectly that there was kind of a, a plot without there being a plot that you know you could take a lot of different meanings from all of the video and i and i feel like people have done just that and um i think the ending especially can be taken on many you know many in many different ways and uh you know the nosebleed is uh capping it off yeah i definitely want people to be able to come away with their own interpretation i think basically the gist of this video is that um I am your only way to salvation. <laughs> Actually, Will Johnson is the only way to Will Johnson salvation. will save us all. He will. In well, this while last we three finish seconds. it up, in this last <laughs> three seconds, I will just say the crew was amazing, absolutely yeah. amazing. Just going out there every day and early, staying late, mm -hmm. braving the heat, making it happen. Just we couldn't have done it without all of you. Yeah, you guys are amazing. Thanks to every single one of you and uh, just for putting in the hours and... Um, yeah, it was a great time, and I'm so proud of it. I'm so proud that this is my first video, and um, so proud of the people that uh, came out and were in it. And uh, thanks, John Collins. Just a really good experience. Thank you for yeah. letting me be a part of it. Thank you, guys. Thank you.